Hello everybody, welcome back to Storytime with Bridie. Today we have something special, a story I've written myself. It's called When the World Spun to a Stop. What did you do when the world spun to a stop? When they shuttered the doors and turned all the locks? Did you suddenly see how our world is entwined and wonder how we could all be more kind? The airplanes were grounded and the ferries stopped. Entire train schedules were totally dropped. All over the earth, our noise was shut down as COVID-19 rolled through our towns. We drew back to our bubbles, alone or together, each with the same brewing storm to weather and the same screeds of time to while away but with different ways to get through a day. So what did you do when the world spun to a stop? Did you sit by the TV, collapsed in a flop? Did you sing from your balcony, dance on your own, learn to bake bread, or just talk on the phone? Did you stock up on lots of toilet paper, hoarding enough to line a skyscraper? Did you wait at the supermarket in an endless line or order on the web to save yourself time? Did you say bye to your dad or your mum, off to a job that had to be done? Or did your parents stay home and work from the kitchen with their meetings online causing much friction? Could you play in the streets and go kick a ball? Or were you not allowed outside at all? Did you love being cosy with your family or would you have preferred to be way out at sea? Did you see the canals in Venice run clear and the Olympics get switched to another year? And when blue skies appeared over India and LA, did you hope they might be able to stay? Did you applaud the doctors and nurses each night as they pass to each other the ongoing fight? Did you shop for a neighbour who needed a hand? Did their grateful smile help you understand? Was your schooling on paper? Was your brother your tutor? Did your teacher check in with you on the computer? If you missed all your friends and wanted to cry, I think that was most of us trying to get by. And what about the animals that started to roam in empty cities past deserted homes? Deer wandered through Japan and London too, while Puma visited Santiago. Crazy, but true. Remember when you gazed at the empty streets and the world was so still you could hear your heart beat. Remember the many we just couldn't save. Remember those who tended them being so brave. So what did you do when the world spun to a stop, when they shuttered the doors and turned all the locks? Each of us has a different tale of trouble, of how we filled time in our quarantine bubble. Looking back, you might see how things started to change from lockdown onwards, and it may even seem strange to imagine just how the world was before, COVID-19 made us think a little more. About how we're all part of a beautiful web, where a difference can be made not just by a celeb, but by you and me, like when the world spun silent and we all stood and wondered at the beautiful quiet. Thank you so much for listening, everybody. Let me know what you think. See you later.